Hello and welcome all signs. So this is going to be your reading. We're going to take a look at what the person that you're currently thinking about is feeling towards you. We'll be reading with Lenormand and then to clarify with a tarot. Make sure to follow and subscribe so you know when I come up with a new reading and thank you all for being here. It means a lot. So let's uh, begin. Aries, so this is going to be your reading. We're going to take a look at what the person that you're currently thinking about is feeling towards you at this moment in time. Let's see. Current feelings. It's like we do have somebody here, Iris, that is feeling they do care for you, they do have these emotions towards you, but I do, it's. Uh, like they they do feel like they need to hold back it's like they're just watching you right now but I do see it more as they being uncertain what it is that you are feeling Aries so it's like they're waiting I will clarify Yeah, Aries. It's like you do have somebody here that is a bit uh, insecure right now in what it is that you are feeling towards them. So instead of uh, acting or saying something, it's like they're going to wait for a sign from you, Aries, before they uh, move forward with this. They do have emotions uh, towards you. They do have this, uh, this love. They do want to be with you, but... I don't see them taking any action right now. It's like just waiting to see what it is that you will do. And they then they will act upon that. Ah. Ah, Iris. They're waiting for you to take some sort of action or give them some sort of sign here. Um, it's like, let's see if Aries uh, comes after me or cares about me. Um, yeah, like I do for them. So, Aries, that's what I had for you. Thank you and uh, bye. Taurus, so this is going to be your reading. We're going to take a look at what the person that you are currently thinking about is feeling towards you at this moment in time. So let's see. Current feelings.
So, Taurus. This, I do see that this is somebody from the past here that is uh, thinking about you quite much here. Starting to, can be they are manifesting something together back with you, Taurus. It's like, where it's like you, it is uh, missing you, Taurus, missing what you had, feeling that things were uh, better before. I do have a fly here. Um, yeah, there is a longing for you, Taurus, um, for what you had in the past with this person. And now it's like, because I do see them wanting to reach out, Taurus. But at the same time, it's because I do see that it has been uh, quite some time that you last spoke. And it's uh, it's just that they don't know how to really do it, or even if they should. But you have been in their mind uh, quite much recently. Oh, it's like they never lost it's like they never lost hope for this for you uh, Taurus yeah I don't see them reaching out anytime soon Taurus but they are thinking about you they do want to I would like to um, bring back this connection but the question is uh, how or where to start so Taurus that's what I had for you thank you and uh, bye Gemini so this is going to be your reading where we're going to take a look at what the person that you're currently thinking about is feeling towards you this moment in time so let's see current feelings gonna clarify this one you have an eye There is a feeling of loss here, Gemini, or that time is running out uh, between you. Like they, it's like they are, there's a feeling that they are losing something great here. Yeah, Gemini. Uh, it's like they know that they are losing you, and 
but at the same time because they no it's they have lost you Gemini but it's like they are not willing to let go of you of this of the idea of you uh, yeah they can't they can't move on you're still with them you're still feeling this feeling you but there's a sense of uh, of lost uh, loss here Gemini and knowing that they need to let go um, but they are still thinking of the possibility of maybe maybe we can be together yeah there's someone here Gemini that is not wanting to let go of you because of the because there is a maybe there or what if they let go and then you come back so I do see a, a, a fear here as well Gemini of moving on and losing this uh, forever or you so Gemini that's what I had for you thank you and uh, bye Cancer so this is going to be your reading we're going to take a look at what the person that you're currently thinking about is feeling towards you at this moment in time let's see cancer gonna clarify I do see this passion that this person has towards you, uh, Cancer. It's like they do see you as, as somebody very attractive. But at the same time, like that's that's all they let me know. Cancer, I kind of do see that their insecurities comes up when they are around you or thinking about you, Cancer, because they do see you as all this uh, beautiful person here, and 
but the insecurities is a feeling of you not being able to be uh, committed or in a commitment um, Oh. They do want you, they do want this, um, they have lots of passion towards you, but there is this feeling of uh, keeping an extra eye on you or just uh, watching you very carefully to see your uh, behavior here, Cancer, because it's a... Uh, it is this feeling of uh, like you being too uh, perfect or too beautiful to be committed uh, committed to just uh, uh, well to them or to just one here yeah so it's a little bit of uh, not trusting you Cancer. Yeah, so they're gonna gonna take it like they're just gonna go with a flow here or take it day by day. They're not gonna invest a lot in you, Cancer, because it's it is this feeling of well, you're gonna end up hurting them or this is all that you are wanting is uh, passion so they're not gonna go all in I do see it more being their uh, insecurities cancer than than your character <coughs> yeah so, cancer, that's what I had for you. Thank you and uh, bye. Leo, so this is going to be your reading. We're going to take a look at what the person that you're currently thinking about is feeling towards you. At this. moment in time So, Leo, can I just say that somebody is coming in here for a reconciliation? Um, and it is... Because uh, it is this feeling, Leo, of them um, not... It's like believing that they really didn't want this. Um, but they just can't stop thinking about you or the the idea of you again or of this leo and 
and it's uh, uh, clarity or something has become clear f uh, for them that they need to to see what it what this is all about so they're gonna come in here and and try once more because they haven't um, they haven't stopped thinking about this connection ever ever since you uh, separated so it's more it is more out of curiosity, Leo, that this person is coming back because it's uh, it is like a it's like an uh, how do you say you just can't get something out of uh, out of your head. They haven't been able to get you out of their head ever ever since they you separated. Yeah. So do you see them coming back here, wanting to try to work on this to see where, because it's a... Uh, it's not a feeling of uh, making a mistake. It's more... A feeling of... just not being able to uh, like something is missing Leo yeah and I need to see what what I what that is yeah so Leo, they are coming back more of curiosity. Uh, I do see that they've been such a long time and that the like the love and passion is gone. This is more feeling that something is missing or something is It, it has felt that something has been missing ever since you separated. So, Leo, that's what I had for you. Thank you and uh, bye. Virgo! So, this is going to be your reading where we're going to take a look at what person that you're currently thinking about is feeling. Towards you at this moment in time. You have somebody here Virgo that do have lots of emotions towards you and I do see them that they just can't hold this in anymore like they need to say something or do something um, Yeah, Virgo can be that it is can be somebody that you've been uh, flirting with, or somebody just being having nice pleasantries with. So I do see them feeling like this. Uh, this is just something that they can't 
hold back anymore they need to uh, say something and see if their if the feeling is uh, mutual that they've been feeling like this for a while now it's becoming this uh, well i just need to see if there is something there there we go yeah a lot of daydreaming here uh, can even be that they have had some uh, trouble uh, sleeping at night because they are thinking about you uh, and almost trying to push themselves to take it to the next step but they have never been able they have never dared to i do see them taking action now virgo because they need to know yeah so virgo can be that you will have somebody here asking you out um, soon because this is something they have been wanting to do well, with these kinds of emotions virgo can i do see them that this is something that they have been wanting to do since the first day you met but uh, you see it because of fear or yeah that they haven't been able to so virgo that's what i had for you thank you and uh, bye libra so this is going to be your reading where we're going to take a look at what the person that you're currently thinking about is feeling towards you at this moment in time current feelings so Libra Kind of do see that you do have somebody here that is wanting to uh, seduce you. Yeah, and it's uh, it's almost like they're gonna say and do anything to achieve, achieve it as well, Libra. Um, but we will see. Yeah, Libra. It is a uh, a lie here. Oh, no, yeah, a lie um, that they are like the way they are presenting themselves uh, towards you, Libra. I do see that this is uh, well, pure seduction. So I don't see them. Uh, I don't see them staying for long. and it's, uh, it's almost like they are saying that they are wanting this uh, stability and and uh, can't even be that they are lying about their their finance or um, yeah but it's the it's almost like they are ready to say anything to succeed or to to achieve uh, this libra can be a yes right now Libra a lot of uh, communication between you we'll see because it's almost like they are going to uh, 
say that uh, something happened on I'm not being able to respond later on after they achieve this Libra with the Eight of Cups here as well. Uh, yeah, I don't see them uh, staying for long. So Libra, uh, I do see um, pure seduction here, and then uh, ghosting or uh, saying that something like an emergency has to, uh, arrived and they need to to leave yeah. so Libra that's what I had for you uh, thank you and uh, bye Scorpio so this is going to be your reading we're gonna take a look at what the person that you're currently thinking about is feeling Towards you. That's this. Moment in time. Scorpio. So Scorpio, can I do see that you do have somebody new here or somebody newer? Because uh, there is a lot of excitement here. Uh, of just uh, thinking about your like starting to plan what what thing you can do next together, um, Scorpio. So it's like you do have somebody here that is, uh, just want to do fun activities with you and just trying to figure out Yeah, it's uh, it is a feeling here that you are building a a good foundation, uh, Scorpio, and it's it's almost this excitement of of uh, of uh, I can't wait to see where where this leads, but it feels good for them. And it's going in the in the right direction here. Uh, like you, I feeling it, you are both on the same page, uh, Scorpio. Yeah, a lot of excitement, uh, and it's like they're ready for this journey to begin. Um, and right now, it is this feeling of just uh, planning or trying to find find out the next the next activity you can do together yeah almost so this is the beginning of something good here Scorpio at least that's what they are feeling so Scorpio that's what I have for you thank you and uh, bye Sagittarius, so this is going to be your reading where we're going to take a look at what the person that you're currently thinking about is feeling towards you. Like this. Moment in time.
Current Williams. It's kind of do see somebody here, Sagittarius. It's uh, us getting getting to know you better, gaining more information about you, and the more things they uh, get to know about you, it's like the more they are feeling this, uh, uh, feeling this, uh, uh, feeling more comfortable with you and feeling all your similarities as well So there is somebody you're having a conversation with Sagittarius and it's almost like you are helping them like you're pulling them out out of uh, a sadness here and it's going faster because they are talking to you like this healing process so there was a feeling here of them not being uh, being ready for something new but they hadn't but they haven't uh, well until they they met you Sagittarius they're starting to feel real comfortable uh, your surroundings and I do see them getting ready for something uh, more and soon yeah so Sagittarius this is somebody you have had a more deeper conversation with so it's just not uh, yeah this is somebody you have been talking to Sagittarius and uh, gone a little bit deeper um, and it's this feeling of uh, of trust that they are evolving towards you so Sagittarius that's what I had for you thank you and uh, bye Capricorn so this is going to be your reading we're going to take a look at what the person that you're currently thinking about is feeling towards you at this moment in time Capricorn. It was the snake that flew out. So I'm gonna take that in consideration when I
need to clarify straight away Capricorn Like you do have somebody here, Capricorn, that wants to talk about a, a problem here or a mistake. Because we did have the snake as well coming out. Um, yeah, but it's almost as something that they've been holding back or not something they have not uh, told you it can just be something they uh, something you do uh, capricorn that annoys them and they want to talk about it or this is uh, uh something bigger like a mistake they have done because i do uh, get this feeling as well Capricorn that after they have um, told you this that there is will that there will be a chance of uh, of fixing it as well Yeah, <clears throat> I do see it more as something they have done, Capricorn, uh, like a, a mistake or something foolish here, because this hope of, of preparing it or the chance or the possibility of still uh, being able to fix this is, uh, is here, so... Yeah. So, Capricorn, a change is coming. Yeah. So, that's what I had for you, Capricorn. Thank you and uh, bye. Aquarius. So, this is going to be your reading we're going to take a look at what the person that you are currently thinking about is feeling towards you at this moment in time Oli there you go he's making his bed but it is over the the sofa so he's uh, scratching to make his bed uh, Thank you. Let's see. Current feelings, Aquarius. What are they feeling? Towards you. Like they have heard something Aquarius or seen something that they uh, did not like and what is the cat doing now what's going on with my animals let's see
it's like this person no Aquarius does there that this opportunity like they've lost an opportunity here um, they took too long or it's like a knowing that their chance that they had um, like they would have acted sooner Aquarius yeah there's a a lot of blame on themselves they're putting a lot of blame on themselves here for not doing anything or for not taking the chance when they had it because now it's uh, it's like they do see you moving on towards uh, something else here Aquarius and knowing that this uh, that this chapter is is uh, closed it's like they uh, they took you for granted and now they regret it because they thought that you will uh, will always be after them or that you always were were there like a like a plan B but now you have moved on and uh, they regret it so Aquarius that's what I had for you thank you and uh, bye Pisces so it's going to be your reading we're gonna take a look at what the person that you're currently thinking about is feeling towards you at this moment in time Current feelings. <coughs> so, Pisces. you do have somebody here that is feeling uh, that this trust or this uh, yeah I just see it as trust Pisces is growing by each day like they can uh, uh, tell you more and more about themselves open up more and more towards you uh, that this connection is Yeah, it is this feeling of uh, them not having this connection before with anyone or that you are pulling out something in them because they are feeling very uh, open with you that they do can talk uh, about anything with you Pisces like very easy to talk to and Yeah, it is this uh, this feeling by this that you are just uh, by each day it's uh, 
is taking a step closer to to this commitment it can be very opposite Pisces as well but that what is uh, that's the thing that makes this work Where you see that this person is somebody um, very serious, uh, closed as well, but not with you. Yeah. So, Pisces. Um, I do see them wanting this and wanting you. You are building this trust, this good foundation. It's like you are bringing out a different side of them that they haven't uh, shown anyone else before. And they know it as well. So, Pisces, that's what I had for you. Thank you and uh, bye.